It's colder than subs and it's balls out here, but I have not been slacking on my training. There's many things going on, so I lost my concentration. So I decided to return to my roots and to get inspiration, which I need. And that inspiration is none other than... This guy is still going. After so many years, he's still doing his thing, which I give him credit. I mean, this is pretty impressive. This guy's been going for years and he hasn't changed his style, hasn't improved, but he doesn't care. He still has his lovely life partner called Sergey. Applause to you, man. Applause to you. Sergey, I mean, I'm a bit jealous. The guy has been close to this epic master for years now, and I'm curious about all the secrets which he uncovered, all the potential of the Mabushi and the mushroom gathering Korean monks. Well, yeah, anyway, a bit jealous. But as you can see here, sometimes he even is able to defeat the master. <laughs> Bushido and Snake and Eagle Master are one and the same, which I would not consider to be possible before. The repertoire itself hasn't changed much from the last few years, but as you can see, he developed a few techniques which can be used for by your children or by you. Who knows? I don't judge. But if the Santa Claus doesn't bring you any presents this year, remember to use this move. Just please don't take it overboard. We don't want any accidents this new year. I've seen in the comments that people have been asking me, like, what is the source of this guy's power? Like, some people say that he looks like a schizophrenic. Some people say he's crazy. Some people say he's uh, drunk. But I think the issue is completely different. I think the source of his power, as I have guessed in the previous videos, are the... Let me be honest, I'm actually pretty jealous about the shrooms. They are needed for the training. In Ukraine, there is this ancient tradition of drinking, you know, these dried mushrooms with some tea, and they open up your mind to like... Well, they don't open up your mind, they change your... They basically open some parts of your brain, which are usually not active, and close the ones which are usually active. So you get these strange hallucinations and see and experience events. I think that the secret of many of these ancient arts, especially the esoteric ones, actually it can be traced back to this. And I have a proof for this. Please check it out. Like when he goes out with his friends, especially Sergei, what does he do? Собрались на рыбалку за грибами. Hey, Sergei, I knew that man. Так, пришли собирать грибы. Раз, грибочек. Он еще, смотри. Вот, еще. Раз, два. Два грибочек. Три грибочек. Эй. Nice. But I've been studying several cultures during these years, and I realized that maybe I was wrong about the previous interpretation of his art. I theorized that he might be copying Power Rangers from 1990s, but looking closely, I think his moves re resemble more of the K-pop-ish style of things. Since in his uh, recent channel, as you can see his channel right now, videos which he posted recently, they all, have, all contain the keyboard Korea, which mean that he's probably... <laughs> Finally opening up to his roots. Let's take a look at what he's been cooking this year. This guy will not plan to stop. He will never stop, I think. He will keep going until the end of days. But to be honest, like jokes aside, this guy has been consistent for so many years teaching his one student called Sergey, which I suspect is more maybe than his student, but whatever. Previously he had a lot of kids joining his home school, home dojo, whatever, but uh, as we can see with these years, all of them probably realize that this bullshit is not efficient and not serious at all. Except Sergey here. I respect. So guys, keep up with your training, keep pushing, get into the better shape, get healthy, get rich, and I wish you luck. See you in the new year, 2024. Bye.